The mall is a popular place in Towson. I like to shop in for the kids. But Wednesday night, it attracted some frightening attention after a man was assaulted and stabbed. It's a little frightening because people like out here like to have fun, you know, get together, go out to eat. It's graduation time. The attack happened in a garage stairwell. A witness took the victim to the hospital. Our community's heart breaks over incidents like that because Towson is such a great, safe place to come to. We're very, very grateful that the man was treated and released. Baltimore County Police say according to the victim, a group of juveniles, boys and girls, attempted to take his belongings inside the mall and then followed him out to the parking garage where they assaulted him. Police tell 11 News they are now looking for 10 to 12 juveniles and detectives are closely following up on leads. Those people will be caught and they will be prosecuted. I can guarantee you. The executive director of the Towson Chamber of Commerce says while incidents involving juveniles have taken place at the mall and throughout Towson, business owners have stepped up efforts to curb violence, thefts, and assaults. She says 90% of the businesses in the area have surveillance cameras and work with police. And the mall spends more than a million dollars a year on security and safety. She calls it collaborative crime fighting and justice. Because we know it's all of our problems when an incident happens here in Towson. County police say since the Memorial Day weekend, they have implemented their summer crime plan, telling us that the department has identified crime patterns and effective countermeasures specific to each precinct using a data-driven approach. Throughout the summer, the plan's effectiveness will be assessed.